Hey guys, I'm here shopping, like the description said, in Amazing Benz, but first let me show you. This is what it looks like when I was talking about it earlier. This is what it looks like. So I'm gonna pull my mask down because I gotta introduce you to this girl. She's like the bean queen, then queen, a <laughs> bean queen. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's been a long day. <laughs> so tell us like about like what's, what is this place? Like, why is this like the coolest place to shop? Well, um, I'm going to say this. It's a shopping experience. Like you have never experienced if you've never been to a bin store. I just want to show you right now. I've got a Christmas item and like your reusable straws. Like who does that in one place? <laughs> right. So in our store, we get hundreds of thousands of items every single week, and we don't have any idea what it's going to be. Yeah. So you literally can have a straw next to a carburetor or a craft item next <laughs> to clothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love this kind of stuff. A phone case next yeah. to, I don't know, a water filter. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's, yeah. it's anything. <laughs> it's a real life treasure hunt. Yeah. So the only thing in our store that we do, obviously, then pack it out, is... That see we all this do stuff. our very best when we are unloading the store to check for things that are topical or ingestible okay. to make sure that they are within date and they are sealed. Okay. If they are not, then we go ahead and dispose of those. So it's I like people are actually looking through things. It's not like somebody just dumps off stuff and you put it in the bin. Correct. Now, there are hundreds and hundreds of thousands of items. We might miss something, but we do, again, our very best. Yeah. During the sales cycle, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, yeah. we have people that go through the bins and pull out trash consistently. They pull out um, things that we might have missed. Yeah, they, yeah. They kind of look through that stuff to make sure that, you That's know, cool. we're making it a fun shopping experience. Yeah, so. because when I was already, like, looking through things, let me tell you, this is my favorite area. And you're going to know why, because I talk about Christmas on my show all the time. See, that's, like, my favorite area. There's been, like, the coolest stuff here. Like, I, I was actually really surprised, because it really is a treasure hunt. I, w I didn't really know what is. to expect. I honestly didn't know what to expect. I really didn't. And then I, I came in, and I was like... It's like you, you're you finding what you want. It's cool. I mean, it's literally, we've seen um, a brand new Michael Kors tag on it. Direct me there. <laughs> um, a lucky lady named Kelly got that. It was The tag said $378. She got it for seven bucks. We never know. We've oh seen Louis Vuitton. We've seen Gucci. We've wow. seen um, brands that, honestly, I'm not that cool. The kids know the brands. They're like, that's a $400 belt. Yeah. Um, what? One of our regulars, Dana has yeah. gotten a couple of Louis Vuitton belts. Her videos are up on our YouTube channel, so you can check them out. Like, this is a legitimate scavenger hunt. <laughs> it is. You never know what you're going to find. So the yeah. only difference in the scavenger hunt is you get a list of things to find. Here, it's just a treasure hunt, because yeah. you never know. Oh, what yeah, I guess, it, yeah, it is a treasure thinking, I really need a reusable straw, but you might find, like, oh, that's a really great deal on protein powder, or, oh my gosh, I needed wrapping paper or gift bags or a stocking or I needed yeah. that whole Christmas tree, whatever. Which so, you all know I have a Christmas tree. I have a holiday tree I decorate for every holiday. I <laughs> love that so much. I'm so serious about Christmas. Well, first of all, tell us about the pricing because it is kind of, it's different than what you it expect. It is. So yeah. it's not like typical retail. So when you come in on Saturday, everything is fresh and brand new. So okay. that's $7. So anything you buy on Saturdays. The only thing that we differentiate is we might charge you less for something. We'll never charge you more than for something. Oh, okay. So the only difference is for books, we have a big thing for reading and literacy. So our books are always $1. Um, if we happen to get a bunch of um, sticker things, we'll do stickers for $1. Oh my gosh, I love stickers. So there might be a few things that we'll <laughs> yeah. charge less than for. Um, so that's kind of the thing. So everything on Saturday is $7. Everything on Sunday, it's been picked over a little bit more, so we dropped the price to five. Yes. Everything on uh, Monday is three dollars, so it's kind of been picked over. Because you're only a open more. three days a week, right? We're only open three days yeah. a week now because we're amazing. We do <laughs> have amazing days that we sprinkle in for special events. Oh, okay. We've done like that amazing bag that you have that's 19 gallons. We've done a fill a bag sale, so you could fill up <laughs> that whole bag. Wow. For 25 bucks. Oh my gosh. So Jeez. We, we okay. We do amazing events throughout the you know throughout the year yeah. for different um, events or you I know love it. whatever yeah. that kind of stuff. So yeah, we always update our Google. We always update our Facebook with our hours and times and stuff like that. Because because it's open three days, that kind of makes it more of the treasure hunt. Because it's not being picked through all week long. It's Correct. like, you got a Saturday to go, you got Sunday to go, and you got Monday to go. Yeah. And it does take us quite a bit of time to clean everything out. Um, the other thing about us that makes us a little bit different is when we are done with our sales cycle yeah. on Tuesday, we go through our bins and pull out all the trash. 
we literally take everything out. We vacuum our bins because, you know, glitter, for example, gets everywhere. You know I like um, that. <laughs> and then we take our items and we separate them into appropriate categories and we donate them. Yeah. So we have a lot of clothing that goes off to various places. Um, books we've sent to the library, for example. Children's summer reading program. And then you said um, you donated a bunch to 180, which is kind of like a shelter here. Yeah. And you had, like, cups and, like... Yeah, All kinds so of things like you could housing donate. things. Yeah. We've done a lot with um, That's so like cool. the um, Florence Critton House here in town, Palmetto Community Care, That's so cool. Low Country Orphan Relief, um, just a bunch of various things throughout town. Yeah, and definitely. We're, you know, we're um, reaching different places to see. You know, if we have something that's more appropriate for like 180 place, yeah. we'll hold it for oh, them. Yeah. Whereas like baby items are really great for Florence Critton House. So yeah. we've made those kind of alliances and we've made that commitment so cool. within our company, um, my husband and myself to give back to our community because we really want to be a part of the solution and not a part of the problem. Exactly. So like that's what's cool about this place is they give back and I'm really, really into that. And one thing that I think is super cool is that you said um, whenever you like go through everything, so it's not like the same stuff. And I like how you said that. You were like, it's not the same stuff. It's like, this is really a variety. <laughs> yeah, it's, I mean, you could have a reusable straw next to a brake pad. You could have... A brake pad. <laughs> uh, yeah, you could have crafting items next to laundry detergent. Yeah. You never... And know that's what I'm looking find. for, craft stuff. <laughs> so think about any item that you could purchase through an e-commerce retailer. Yeah. Any e-commerce retailer. Wow. You have the potential to find it here. That's amazing. Yeah. That's so cool. I mean, it's... You don't have to just come for like, oh, I really want that Michael Coors purse I was talking yeah. about. Because you're going to find like laundry detergent's expensive. If I can pick up laundry detergent for $7, heck, I might even find it on $3 day. Yeah, yeah. That saves my budget a lot. That does. Uh, I mean, that's really good. And I will say that since I've been in here, they do have masks. People are wearing yep. masks. I'm yep. taking it down so I can talk. And we are six feet away. That's why it's awkward. Yeah. <laughs> and, but they are doing CDC guidelines. Hand yeah. sanitizer, six hand feet away. Everywhere. Yeah, six feet away. Don't be like getting up in everybody's space. So they are following all the CDC guidelines, which is what we have to right now. Right, of course. So, um, so I would totally come down here. Where are you guys located? Fifteen oh five Greenleaf Street. Okay. Um, we are four doors down from the U.S. Chef store on Meeting Street. So if you know where, right where that is. <laughs> Mask. Exit 219B. <laughs> okay. Um, East Bay, hang a left on Meeting Street, and we are down on the right. All right. It's so convenient. They have plenty of parking. You should totally come down here. Like I said, Saturdays are 7, Sundays are 5, and Mondays are 3. This is where I will be for the rest of the day, guys. Because you know how I feel about Christmas. But thank you so much. Christmas in July. Oh, what? Let me tell you about Christmas in July. Tell me about Christmas in July. I know you love Christmas. Christmas in July is a special event that we're doing for the month of July. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So we filled it up last weekend, sold everything in this in this special little area for $7. Oh my god. This week we've topped it off with what we had left. Now everything is $5. I can't even. And so like the Christmas trees are for sale, the stockings, the advent calendars, all the bags and packaging I love and all it. that kind of stuff. Love so this it. is normally an area that would be filled in with our normal merchandise, but I love Christmas, I think, almost as much as you do. Oh, my gosh. And you so made it like a... <laughs> yeah, so if you need an elf on the shelf this year... Um, like there is one. one of those. What? We have Santa sacks. We have, I love it. I love it, love it, love it. all kinds of different stuff in here. Christmas lights and tinsel This is and so great. This is, like, my favorite. All that See, that's why you can get, like, you can get early on Christmas, but there's also Christmas presents out here, too, that you can buy. <laughs> yeah, so if you're a crafter and you make things to sell, for example, or give us gifts, and you yeah. want to get started early in the summertime, so you have your things for fall craft shows and fairs. Yeah, this is the place to you go. Can come and get it at a discount. I know? love it. I mean, I I thought it's been like the coolest experience in here. Everybody is unbelievably nice. Everybody is so kind to talk to. They're very conscious. They'll hold your bag for two hours. I mean, I'll seriously, help you to your car. Like this is the place to go. This is where you guys need to be looking. Okay, so check it out. Amazing bins. I tagged them in this post. So go check it out. This is my girl. She's amazing. At least you're so cool. Thank I like you. So you. Much. I think <laughs> I'm gonna go shopping now. So see you guys. Bye.